Hello. Hello. How are you? How are you? Good. How are you? Freaking fabulous. Yeah. How you doing, sir? All right. Can I see the dog? Can you go put the dog on the leash over here? Because if they take her, they're taking me. No, we're taking the dog. And me. We're not taking you. How are you going to get the dog for me if I have a hold of the dog? You're going to let go of the dog. Because he's bringing the dog to me. Okay, it's not your dog. And I'm not returning her to an abusive owner. It's not your dog. I went to the owner's house. The owner's house is just a nice house. So okay. why is she tied up outside, getting beat, left out there for hours in the snow, has an ear infection, possibly parvo, because I took her to the vet because she's puking and shitting everywhere. Okay, well, I will check out the dog. Okay, why okay. I'm on there. Yeah, that's that note. Huh? That's okay. That note. Just got it. Oh, oh, I'm in the back. I'm bringing the dog to you. Okay. Do you mind if we come in and see it? Do you mind if we come in and see it? No, I'll bring her out here. You don't need to come in my house. Okay. Do you mind if I stand in here where it's not raining on yeah, top of it? Yeah, sure. Go ahead. Yeah. Thank you. You can stand right there. Back up, Dallas. Go back up. No, you probably we're taking the dog. Yeah, we're taking it's the dog. It's up to the warden. <laughs> it's a big dog. No, you see that? Don't give us a dog back. We'll just do it fast. Yep. I'm going to grab it. I'm grab it. Just give us a dog, dog. Hey, puppy. Hey, go watch you. Hey, Dee. Come on. <clears throat> okay. Was this the collar that was originally on it? Nope. Where's that collar at? Uh, in there somewhere in my arm. Can you get that, please? Can you see if we still have the collar? Because I probably threw it away. Hey, puppy. You can tell they had her chain on the porch. Okay. Alright. No, 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 if you take her, you're taking me. Sir, can you get your wife before she goes to jail? Guys, I'm uh, probably going to go to jail on this video. I don't even have her collar. You have her collar, sir. First off, don't touch my up. phone. Don't touch the phone. Either give me my phone or we won't have an issue. Whoa! whoa don't put your ears on me first off. Locker. Back up. Don't hit me first off. Back up. Hey! Call me back. <sighs> First off, that's my car's leash, or you ain't going nowhere with my car's leash. First off, you need to come in too. No, stop. No, stop. No, stop. She's no. not going to jail. Stop. She no. ain't. No. Stop. No, no, no. Please, let him go. Let him go. Let him go. Go inside. Come on, no, no, he's fine. going too. He's going. Oh, yeah, I'll go. Stop. Put him on the ground. I'll go. Please put his mom down. He is schizophrenic. Please let his mind get him. <laughs> Sir, will you please let his mind get him? You can take me. He's schizophrenic. Not a 25, just send one more car. <laughs> We're secure. Bro, they already sleeved him to the ground. Here. Yeah. This is late for Dally! Oh, he's just Put it on this first. Okay. Go ahead, baby. Go on. Go on. Go on. You got him. Come here, puppy. Pup, see? What are you doing? Come here, girl. Come here, girl. It's okay. Come here. Hey. Hey. Come here. You're okay. Good girl. Come here. Hey. Come here. You're okay. It is all over a dog. And I was gonna let you guys take me. The medic's coming. Ma'am. Okay, I will walk. She told me to go. I will walk. May I ask why you guys are taking him? Sir, I can walk. Can you stop pulling me? Then please? walk. I am, sir. I have a surgically repaired foot, so I cannot walk her fast. I apologize. Now, would you like me to call her so she'll come to you? Sit in the car. Would you like me to call her? Sit in the car. Come here, baby. There you go. I got her. Get in the car. 
How do I get in the score? You sit in the car. I'm trying. <clears throat> Sir, can you please be nice and help me pull my pants up because they're coming down. I just don't understand hey, what Hey, will you go check on that lady back there? She's having like a seizure or something. May I ask why you're taking that doll back to an abusive home? I can't pull your pants up like this. Alright. So May I ask a question? Do not go ahead, I'm here. I'm gonna have to settle out of court. I'm gonna check on them. Huh? Should be he was fine. Okay. You okay? Yes, I'm good, but my hands are numb. You said your hands are numb? Yeah, sir. Can you turn around? All I was literally trying to do is. I I don't need to hear anything. Why are you taking these to jail? Alright, I can fit two fingers in there. Okay. Was this worth it? I mean, uh, for a dog? Liter Sir, literally, I said I just want the leash and collar back, and that's what I was going to grab. No, that's not what happened. I, I was going to give you all that back. At first, yes, I did try to stop the dog. No, the you tried to stop me from getting the dog. Right, I did. And then I grabbed the dog. And, but once you guys were off of the sun porch, I was literally just going to unstrap the collar and take the leash and collar. I guess it's me trying to protect the dog because me going to jail, and I guess it is what it is. When you have 10 people messaging you telling you this one abuses a dog, would you like the dog over there? Well, it's, it's theft if you don't. And I didn't know that. It's, dogs are property. I've rescued other dogs and have not went to jail for it. Oh. Honestly, if she went on the phone, he answered one simple question of what collar the collar was and what the phone number was on the collar, so I really knew it was her dog. She could have had that dog. But she didn't even tell me those two things. What's your name? Tiffany. Social? I don't know. You don't know your social? Nope. Date of birth? I don't know it. You don't understand that's not going to stop you from going to jail. If I'm going to jail, why do I have to give you any information? Tell you what, if you cooperate, I'll take those handcuffs off. August 23rd, 1997. What's your husband's name? Is that your husband or boyfriend? It's my fiance. Fiance. I'm not giving you guys any of his information. He's going to give it to us. Huh? He's going to give it to us. If he chooses to, that's on him. How are we going to know if, if he has a medical emergency? How are we going to know what to look up for his medicine? Well, you clearly won't get his medicine that he needs to. We're, we're going to so. get it. Well, from where? It's all in the house. Okay. Well, you guys are going to have to give us permission to go inside and get it. Or your mom can go in and get it. I need I it. I you to get it and you're in here not getting it. Well, that's that's not a priority right now. It is when he's schizophrenic and he has medical okay. help. He has mental health issues that if he don't take his medicine for, he will try to kill himself over. Okay. Well, he's in handcuffs right now in the back of a cruiser. Which What's, isn't even scary. Listen, you are delaying this whole process of me getting his medication. Just tell me his name. Terry? Alright, I'm going to take the tough stuff. You're going to be cool? Well, what else am I going to do? Well, you can not do be cool. Do I have a choice? A choice of what? Do I have a choice to be cool if you take the cuffs off? Obviously not. But if I don't be cool, then I go back in cuffs. So you're going to be cool? That's the only choice I have, so yes. I need, okay. Turn around for me. Offer circulation. Huh? Let's talk to my partner. All right, sit tight. He, he needs to be cleared because he was taken to the ground. Yeah, he's got. He's stating that he's having a panic. All right, he's got. He go to the hospital. Yeah. The hospital would be better. I need to get his info though. I didn't grab anything. He's going to the hospital though. We can get it there. All right, man. All right, listen. You're okay. Okay. All right, we're gonna get you to the hospital. Get you checked out. Okay. Where's your medication at inside? Um, you just have to ask my mom. Okay. Ma'am, I need Sorry. your I need your son's medication. Oh my gosh, you take. Don't go 
Come on now. Your dog's put up? Is that all of it? I don't know. Thank you. I appreciate that. I would appreciate it if you guys would just let them let him go. We'll do what we can. We're taking him to the hospital right now just to get checked out. He's having a panic attack. So. He has right. some bad. Yeah. Okay. We'll be in touch. Thank you. Yep. Male's medication. He was taken down the do you know the history or the story of the call? Uh, dog. These people yeah. had it. They didn't want to give it back. She didn't want to give it back. Um, I went to grab the dog. She, she like huddled around the dog. I moved her arm off of it, grabbed the dog. She lunged forward, tried to get the dog and pushed me out of the way. Um, then the husband, I, put, I was going to put her in cuffs. The husband tried fighting me. Gotcha. So this, this is their house, right? Is everybody in there? The mother's in there. Uh, another family member lived there. She had a uh, seizure and went to the hospital. Okay, so I'm good, man. Thanks. You got the dog? Yeah, I'm this dog over. Okay, I appreciate it. Yep. All right, go ahead and do whatever you need to do, and I'll see you at headquarters when you're done. Yes, sir. Thank you. Look, I'm a dog lover, too. Um, but you can't steal other people's dogs. And then you can't resist the police. You know what was considered theft. And you could have said that. And you're like, look, you don't let go of the dog. It's considered theft. I did say that. And you said, I don't care. You're going to have to take me, too. I heard you say you can't keep the dog. And that's when I said, I don't care. You'll take me. Well, if a police officer says you can't keep the dog and you decide to keep the dog, what do you think that is? Well, I didn't know that was theft. Okay. Well, ignorance of the law does not allow for breaking the law. I'm sorry. I said, ignorance of the law does not allow for breaking the law. So all because of a dog, you and your husband are going to jail. Your sister is going to the hospital. Let's like put it into reality of what it is. Okay. Because I'm a good human and try to save a dog. Okay. When you have several, not just a couple, several people think she beats this dog. Several people think she beats this dog kind of outside. Several people saying they've seen him running. Ma'am, do you think? People saying they caused him to be Do you think if I have evidence of someone beating an animal that I'm going to give that animal back to them? Was I even able to show evidence? What people's texts, people's words? That doesn't mean anything. Did you guys look and see if people really called the humane society about this dog before? No. Did you call the humane society, or did you take her dog? Okay. Did I take her dog? No, actually, her dog was running down the street almost got hit. Hey, dogs get out and get loose. It happens. I understand that you were being a good person and going to get the dog out of the street. Not because now I'm going to jail. You're going to jail because of your actions. Not because you tried to save a dog off the street. Did you all at least tell her a dog needs to go back to the vet in two weeks? I think she has car I bet not. Did you guys even look at the vet? Ma'am, do you see where I'm at and what I had to deal with tonight? I haven't even had time to call her. I understand dogs are important to you because they are to me, but okay. this right now is is higher priority than that dog. He's saying you can't have a dog because she's being beaten. It's more priority than actually checking the dog and looking at the paper before you get the dog back to her. Ma'am, you didn't even give me the dog to check it out. You guys looked at her? You took all the, to you took all of the possibilities out of my hand and you forced my hand. When he was walking away, all I was going to do was unstop and unsnap my collar. That's not true because collar. I tried to unsnap the collar and you took my hand away. So I don't know I don't know where you're coming up with this stuff, but that's not what happened. On the some point, yes, she did try to unsnap the collar and I put my arm around her. I'm talking about after... That's too late after that. You are... And, I, and, you, and your partner was already outside off the sun porch with the dog and I walked out and reached down and unsnapped the collar and that's when I got arrested. Um, I'll let you know here in a little bit. I said I'll let you know here in a little bit. I can't know now. I should have a right to know what I'm being charged with. Okay, and you do, and you will know here in a little bit. I went back to the judge, so I can tell them that I asked what I was charged with, but wasn't allowed to find out until hours later. You'll probably talk to the judge tomorrow. I'm sorry? So you'll probably talk to the judge tomorrow. Do I stay here overnight? Well, you're going to stay at county overnight. You're I not going to... find out? Uh, you might be able to. Because I have no priors. Okay. Well, you can talk to them about it. I can't I can't give you that answer. But he's going to the hospital first to get cleared. Can I ask you what's wrong with him? He's having a panic attack. 
Okay, well, I gave the ambulance, or the EMS people his medicine, and they're taking him to the hospital. But he realizes he hears voices and sees stuff that normal people don't. Okay. And I was trying to ask you guys to let his mom get No, it's too late. He already grabbed us. You can't do that. There's no coming back from that. Why do people get shot about all the time? Just do it to me, too. All right, here's the deal. I'm going to take you into our holding facility. I'm going to leave you unhandcuffed. But if you act up, you're going back in handcuffs. You understand? No, you can talk. I prefer if you keep it professional, but... Alright, come on. I'm going to go on the left side of this van. Room here. So you can go in that room straight back there. Have a seat. Or stand. <laughs> 